What's up guys? Got an exciting video for you here today. Today Tesla just put out a video on its Megapack business. I believe the Megapack business will be just as big as the automotive side. But with the Megapack business, I truly believe that this can push Tesla over the edge and be the catalyst that makes Tesla the most valuable company in the world. So I think this is gonna be absolutely massive for Tesla as a business. If we look in this past year on their earnings report on Q4, it said for 2022, total of deployment of 6.5 gigawatt hours in 2022. So at 40 gigawatt hours, if you divide that by the megapack size, which is about four megawatt hours, that gives you like what they said in the video is 10,000 megapacks produced per year and them selling at anywhere from 1.8 to 2.6 million, depending on how much, uh, how big the order that they get is. Uh, 10,000 times, say, let's do an average of 2 million, 20 billion in revenue for 2023 additionally. So right now, this past year, they did 80 billion. That adds 20 billion in revenue. That's not where it's gonna end. If we look at their impact report in 2020, by 2030, we're aiming to sell 20 million electric vehicles per year compared to half a million in 2020, as well as deploy 1500 gigawatt hours or 1.5 terawatt hours of energy storage per year compared to three gigawatt hours in 2020. 37 times increase in storage. So if we do the 15, the 1.5 terawatt hours divided by four megawatt hour battery pack, that would equal 375,000 megapacks per year at 2 million each, which I believe the cost will go down substantially, but at 2 million each, that's 700 billion in revenue. 700 billion in revenue. If we look at the top companies in the world by revenue in 2022, Walmart's number one at 600 billion, but if we look at the, the top eight, Saudi Aramco, Sinopec, PetroChina, Exxon, and Shell, five of the top eight are oil companies, oil and energy companies. So Tesla is coming for trying to be one of the top energy companies in the world, as well as electric vehicle companies in the world. So this is what I think why it will be the catalyst to pushing Tesla to be by far the most valuable company. It's going to be competing with these, you know, top five companies in the world in terms of revenue, as like we just did the math, it could potentially be a 500 billion in revenue per year, just on its energy business, not to mention the autonomy and selling 20 million electric vehicles, 20 million by just give it an uh, average sale price of 30,000 is 600 billion. So right there, it could be double what the next highest company is in terms of revenue. And with you know solid margins right now, that income right now is about 16%. So you know, you do, if they become a trillion dollar company at 16%, that's 160 billion in net income, which just makes it a multi-trillion dollar company and would potentially be worth, you know, double. And like Elon said in one of the recent quarters that it could be worth Saudi Aramco and Apple combined. So right now being worth around 500 billion, almost 10 times increase from where it is today. It's not like any of this is new to people that have been following the company. Um, they've been talking about this Lather factory for a while. 
if you follow Zero Sum Game on Twitter, Warren Redlick's been talking about this, but this 40 gigawatt hour is just really the start to where they wanna to grow to the 1.5 terawatt hours per year. And like we just talked about, it could be worth, I mean, it really just depends on how much you think a mega pack will cost in the future. Even if it's a million dollars per mega pack, which would be cut the price in half, it's still 375 billion in revenue per year, just from that side. They have so much to grow. This is just the beginning of Tesla as a growth company. Here's another chart of looking at the companies, uh, the top market cap companies and how much they grew in revenue this year. And Tesla is one of the only companies that's been growing substantially. This is the beginning of the company. Don't get it wrong. A lot of people are saying, oh, it's it grew too fast, it's overvalued. This is the beginning of their growth. Retail investors are just you know ahead of the game, but they have so much to grow. Like I just said, they have third, they have potential to grow 37 times in their energy business. And I still think they only did 1.3 million vehicle deliveries this past year in 2022. And their goal is 20 million by 2030. They wanna be about 20% of the electric vehicle sold, or just 20% of the vehicle sold per year at about 100 million cars sold per year being 20%. So this is just the beginning, close to a 20 times in their car side, 37 times in their energy side. <laughs> Put that together. This company is just getting started. Tesla's headed to the moon. Yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. My name is Sean. I'm the Tesla Hyperbowl, and I'll see you guys next time.